welcome to your March uh, monthly forecast. Now let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Okay. Looks like things look so good. Well, financially, it will be very good for you this month. As you'll be receiving some good news. If you're also starting a new job, then I feel like this is definitely the month for you. Hmm. Let's take a look at your love life. Hmm. Okay, that flip. <clears throat> Let's just put it here. Looks like Virgo, you're also going through some periods of distress in your relationship. Okay. Alright, the single, let's take a look. Okay, let's take a look first at your general. Okay, now there will be a brand new beginning that will be coming your way. Plus, it will also be, um, you know, like giving you some longevity, um, prosperity as well. Looks like there's a good news that will be coming your way. Um, and, well, it will be around third week of this month, not anytime soon, but... Um, you are just waiting for the right time for you to go it seems like this brand new beginnings will be mm, in another place you're just waiting for the right time to act upon but if you're already married or already with someone there is a, a bit of a sacrifice that you have to make while you're working and while there is this um you know call for you you need to sacrifice your time for your family or for your loved ones or for you know with your children just for you to solidify this uh, brand new beginnings okay that's the little bit of a sacrifice that you have to make and presumably that's also the bad news okay that you need to be far away from them and this is also the reason you know well this actually explains why you're gonna have or why, why you're going to experience some uh, betrayal in your love life. Because it also appeared here that you will have a heartbreak, you know, over a deception. Or, you know, over someone who's been, um, who will be committing something right behind you. Okay? And because of that, you will know about it. You will feel about it. You already have some inkling feelings or there are already some red flags in the past. And now that if you will be pursuing this or if you will be moving away or will, you will be taking this job outside of your city, then it will just entail more into bigger damages. The thing here is if your relationship hasn't been working for the past few months or weeks or even years, then I feel like this is the time that you will be um, 
this is a this is the time that you will be um having some big problems to face. Okay, when it comes to your relationships, as to where you should go, which direction you should be pursuing, or if this is really the right thing for you to do. I feel like if you've been having some, you know, back and forth and doubts about your relationship, and if you've been having, and you've been asking for some signs and symbols, then I feel like take take this as a sign. Okay. Even though it's going to be very difficult for you to go through with this whole thing on your own, I feel like you will also find out that someone around your friends or family knows about the whole thing. And unfortunately, they've been, you know, like they all know except you. And so you will be disconnecting yourself from your friends or families and because of the, uh, the lies that you will be discovering and you feel like a fool. Because everybody knows except you, okay? And now you're wishing for you to be successful and you just want for everything to be, you know, like to grow and be more stable. And that is how you're going to be getting back at that person who hurted you. So will there be a, um, like a divorce or separation? It's, mm, well, it hasn't come out yet, okay? You're not yet there. I don't feel like you're ready for that, but... You want to reestablish yourself. You will be taking this job, okay, um, out, out, um, out of the city or out of the country, wherever it is. And you will be away from your um, loved ones or from your family. But if you already have a children, I feel like you will be taking your children with you. It will only take a few weeks, but you want your children with you, definitely. Now, um, when it comes to your workplace... Communications will be a little bit blocked. There will be some team building or team play or project or something that you need to work with other people. And most of you are not going to be understanding one another. There will be some, let's say, for example, that you say something that the other person interprets this in a different way. So it will be very difficult for you to express yourself, even though that it will be resulting in a very good uh, productivity or result. You are going to be bumping heads into some people into your workplace, and because of this, you will have a hard you know you will have a hard time going through with the four weeks of this month, and you will also be under a lot of stress. But at least that the uh, that worker project that you need to get completed it will be completed in a very timely manner you will also be traveling and you would love to there is like a big event that you have to attend almost for a month or um, or for a week and you're really looking forward to this now be very careful with a fire son who will try to sabotage you and will try to you know ruin your foundation or ruin your reputation while you're away but don't worry because someone will be backing you up and that person will be thwarted by this older air sign woman and you will definitely have your success don't worry your guy then you're protected okay it's just that i feel like because you will be having a lot of success and a lot of things this month, um, well, good success and good things, the only um, bad thing that's going to be coming your way will be all about personal connections and personal relationships. And again, when it comes to your love life, you will be discovering that your partner has been seeing somebody from the past or has been talking to somebody from the past and they're already planning to be together or they're already planning to get together. Even though you're not yet ready for your divorce or for your separation, you want to get back in a certain way. While you are celebrating your victory and while you're celebrating your newfound foundation and to, you know, you expect that your partner will be congratulating you or something like that, they will be ridiculing you or they will be scrutinizing you more. They will be like, you know, sarcastically congratulating you. But it seems like it will just end up in a very um, harsh conversations and arguments. And this is where you're going to start thinking, like, why is it that the reaction of your partner, that instead of being happy for you or being supportive, it's like they are so unhappy that you're going up or that you are rising up. 
right after all the hurdles that you have gone through in the past and it's like you're you know it's it's like a big puzzle for you now hmm Mm-hmm. Now the thing here is there will also be some talks about finances, assets, properties. But since that you're the one who put up with a lot of, you know, a lot of things that you have right now, I feel like it will be 60-40 if you will be reaching up to the divorce and you won't be able to work it out. I feel like your partner is going to be wailing out because they want more. But if you're the woman, I feel like you will have more. But if you're with a fire sign, it seems like the fire sign wants to have your house. And wants you to feel so sorry for everything that you have done to them. So for them, it's like you're the one who hurted them and you're the one who will... who. Who created all of these troubles i'm not saying that it's your fault i'm just saying that this is the uh, the mindset of your partner okay that they just want you to pay up for whatever it is that you did to them because they feel like you have hurted them oh what a life so anyway when it comes to you singles looks like you are swinging back and forth with multiple partners and by the time that you're ready to take someone seriously or commit or take it take it up to the next level you will find out that this person has been not so loyal and faithful to you and everything that they were claiming in the past are just all bs okay so you will be freeing yourself up from this and right before you know it there is another mm, younger fire son around 35 or 34 and at the time that you are trying to heal yourself from this other person, especially if it's an air sign, you will be saved up by this fire sign and you are going to have a lot of confusion because while you're trying to work it out with this fire sign, you will still be doing it or sleeping with this air sign because you have a lot of feelings for this person. But what this person wants is to have a casual connection, but you just want, but he just wants you to stay there. He or she, okay? So, obviously, you don't want to settle for that, you know? And little by little, you will be freeing yourself up from this person because it's such a toxic connection. And not to mention that they're, you know, they will be parading their other options in front of you, which is really disrespectful. Now, when it comes to your health... You'll have a hard time getting up or standing up for a long period of time, okay? Uh, problems with your knees and problems with your back. Now, you also need to take care of your bones. For women, you need to start uh, going to the doctor for your breast exams and reproductive system. Check out, especially if you have PCOS, PCOS. And um, you also need to take more organic stuff, you know meds, supplements, food, whatever it is that you use in your body, use something organically because you're going to have some allergic reaction to a brand new product that you will be turning into. And it's much better if you will be having a um, balanced diet and you will be sticking around with vegetables this month. All right. Seven of action, you're being called upon to claim your personal power. Feel confident as your angels will give you the strength to say no when it's the right thing to do for yourself. Your struggle may actually stem from an unresolved inner conflict rather than a conflict with others. Review and contemplation, you've accomplished a great deal in your life and you have much to be proud of. Now it's time to decide what's next as you contemplate the past and the present. You'll get clear in your divine life purpose. Don't be distracted by conventional thinking and be the real you. Six of emotion, memories can fill your heart with many emotions. It's important to remember your past accurately. Without seeing it as a better or worse than it was, people you used to know may return to your life unexpectedly. 
Children could be an important issue as you may need to reconnect with your own inner child. Master, you have thought a new topic or intellectual project is really exciting for you. There's so much to learn before you feel ready to move forward. New information may require changes to your plans. Review all documents carefully. You know, we'll meet or are someone who loves to learn and share knowledge. This person is brilliant, truthful, and but also blunt and not very diplomatic. Now, the six of emotion, um, it's, um, you're falling more into nostalgic okay or nostalgia the reason why you're going to be holding on to this relationship is because of what might have been what could have been and what you've been through in the past but you know to yourself that you've been asking for some signs and symbols whether you're going to just let go of this relationship or not and you're also being called to you know claim your personal power ask your higher self you know what is the right thing to do and there's also a message you have thought, so pay attention to your dreams, okay? Anyway, that's it for you for this month of Virgo. And if you want to talk to me live on the live of the cost, just go and visit me at my website, ansofangel.net. Blessings to you.